Hi, it's Aiden. Today I'm going to show you my Clone Wars amusement park and my clock tower. And I'll show you how that works in a minute. So, here's my um, Clone Wars amusement park. So, I've got all my battle droids right here. This is target practice. And they ripped off all their arms, so they can't do anything and fight back. All their arms are right here, and if they want to challenge, they can put them back on and use them. Then I've got my magic place over here. This guy's the magician. Instead of wearing a Clone Wars helmet, he's wearing a magician magician's hat. And instead of using a wand, he's using a blaster. So let me show you how it works. So he says, Alpha Zan, Clone Trooper, you will now fly. And then that and then he does that and he flies basically. Now I'm gonna lower him down. And let me show you how it's done. So back here I have this piece with the circle which is connected to that with a technic piece and then it and then when you twist this it goes up until that reaches that and that there's a block in it so you don't see it all right now i'm gonna show you my rocket ride let me connect the hub and the motor all right so this one is connected to a so, I can make them go like that, or the other way. But it doesn't really look um, very different. And if I took the motor out of here, then I could have controlled the speed for him. But I had to use that motor in here for the clock, because the clock can't, do, can't go too fast. Alright, now I'm going to show you my building. Right here. So that's the business level, but right there, um, I didn't make a full roof. So there is the motor sticking out, so you can turn it on. I'll show you what that does in a minute. Down here we've got our business levels. They're a little bit hard to see. There's a person in here buying a outfit for Halloween. That's the Star Wars one. If I turn it to the front, you can kind of see the outfits. And then here's the clothing store. And there is no one in there right now. So the person is just sitting there waiting. Then right here, I've got my um, clockworks level doesn't have a lot except for that which i just made doesn't doesn't do anything so i've got um all my wires and motors which connects to that to turn the clock and lights i'll show you the lights in a second let me link this up all right and connect the two so there are my lights i'll turn off my other light and you can see the clock move, moving then when I turn off my lights then you can just see the clock moving I can make it slower so that's the slowest it can go and it can go faster this has about six speeds on it and then it can go the other way, which is clockwise, or it can go counterclockwise. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Make sure to subscribe and like.